okay, let's hope this works because I've tried to make a video like 12 times already and every single time I try to do it, I get halfway through the video or like near the end and all of a sudden it cuts off because I keep running out of memory on my phone. It's really upsetting. So anyways, here's an update. I know I haven't been updating in quite some time and I apologize about that. I really do. Um, I, I've just been, it's, I've been so busy. It's been like a lot of working and then when I come home I'm just usually exhausted if I wake up I usually am doing some kind of errand or chore I've got something going on and then I go to work and then I just come home and I'm exhausted so I do apologize um, I don't have a list of things that I wanted to talk about so if I leave something out I'll just make another video for it oh my god my hairspray but um so yeah, I know I need a haircut. My hair, I'm starting to use my girlfriend's straightener because my hair is just wavy and crap and I just need to fix it. And then once I do that, I need to get new headshots. So yeah, that's why I haven't got my hair cut yet. Um, Cause new headshots, good headshots are like 400 bucks. So if anything, I just need to find someone who does headshots for free or is looking to build up their portfolio, which I have a guy who I just need to get some time to be able to get the headshots done with him. Because as of right now, he normally only has off during the week um, and, like, gets off early on Fridays. So I need to, like, figure something out. Because Fridays are my money-making day and so are Saturdays. So I normally can't do anything on Friday or Saturday except maybe I can meet up with him early. Anyways, point two. I've been working a lot. So with work, I will make a whole different video for that because it's, I tried making a video originally and I had realized that I was at like four minutes and I was just ranting about work. So I'm going to make a video hopefully on Monday because Sunday I am busy. And what am I busy with? I am busy with an X-Wing tournament. X-Wing, you might ask, well, that is a tabletop miniatures game, okay? So basically it's played on a board, like, well, a mat. And um, you have little miniatures, probably, they're like about this big. I wish I had one with me, but I don't, because they're all at home. And they look like little uh, Star Wars um, fighters, you know, little space fighters. So there's X-Wings, there's TIE Fighters, etc., etc. And what you basically do is you set your maneuvers and you play the game similar to chess, where you try to outsmart your opponent. Um, but then when you're uh, pointed at each other or you point at someone else and they're not pointed at you, you get to fire upon them using dice to roll for hits. It's extremely fun. I suggest if you guys are fans of tabletop games, you check it out because it is highly addictive and there are competitions, which right now there are store championships, which leads up to regionals, regionals to nationals, nationals to worlds, and you know, world finals. So it, that's like you're the best in the world. So as of right now, I've already done one store championship, which I came in 33rd out of 66 people. I beat three people and then the next three I lost to. So I was just pretty much smack dab in the middle which was a little upsetting, but for my first ever big store ch championship tournament, I felt good about it, and I learned a little bit, and now I'm using a different squad to try to go into this tournament. And if that doesn't work, then I have one more tournament until regionals. And, um, you know, so I'm trying to perfect my, my squad before I go and do these big tournaments. Uh, anyways, so there's X-Wing, there was work. Um, oh, acting. So the acting that's involved right now I, uh, I was in a commercial the other day, and it was amazing. Hold on. This is ridiculous. There's a guy in the middle of the road, like, parked, so no one can really do anything. Thank you. Sorry, you didn't see that. You didn't see that. Um, anyways. So, uh, yeah, acting, I was in a commercial the other day, which was awesome. It was last Friday, because today is Saturday that I'm making this video. Last Friday, I was in a commercial for Netflix. Technically, it's a spec commercial, which if you guys don't know what a spec commercial is, it is a commercial that basically is used to add to the director's reel, you know, like an acting reel, but it's the director's reel, as well as they're going to pitch it to the company to try to sell it to them and the idea or um, the script for it or just the actual commercial itself. So basically I was in that, which is always good because of the fact that that's still something I get to put on my resume. So I get to go ahead and put it on my resume as well as on my demo reel. And I've got about another week until I need to message them again and figure out if the editing's all done. And then once it's done, I'm definitely gonna be posting it everywhere so that way people can see. The concept of it was that a guy is moving into a new house 
invites all of his friends over to help him move. After they help him move, they go ahead and have a pool party. After the pool party, they go ahead and watch Netflix at the end of the night. So it was really cool because, uh, you know, I got to meet a lot of awesome people. Um, I got to be on like an actual, the closest thing to like a professional set um, that I can possibly find. And um, you know what, if anything, I'm going to go ahead and make another video for this as well. Because I, I, it's just, it's, there's a lot to it. And I remember explaining it all to my girlfriend and stuff. And it was just really, really cool. So I was in that commercial and I'm really excited about it. So I'll definitely have an, more explanation to it. Because I don't want to keep running up to these like 10 minute videos of just vlogs. But anyways, the last thing I wanted to say was that um, I was also on The Price is Right. Not being on it, I didn't get to come on down and play any of the games, which is really sad, and I know I shouldn't lead with that. But Sam and I went um, and got tickets to The Price is Right last Tuesday, and we went ahead and um, we got to go and sit in the, we were in the front row of it, which was awesome, because now when the cameras show, we're going to be like, you can see us, and I'm in a bright blue shirt, so you can't miss me. And um, you got to see the people playing. You got to shout out the numbers, like "No, do 400!" And it was so it was really cool. Um, we've also mutually agreed that we're going to go ahead and try to get tickets again as soon as possible, so that way we can go ahead and actually um, uh, try to win more prizes or win prizes in general. And uh, yeah, it was it was really cool, and um, it was free, so why not? Uh, except for the fact that we had to pay for parking, which parking is ridiculous. So next time we're going to actually take a bus there, so that way we don't have to pay for parking. And um, just parking was like 20 bucks. Then, as I was driving back from um, from Price is Right, I got a call from someone who I had placed an application for about a week ago. And it was for another game show, oddly enough. And the game show was for Epic Game Show. I guess it's like a new game show coming out. And they're filming it within the next 8 to 10 weeks. Basically, it's like Wipeout, which is like the American version of the most extreme elimination challenge where you have like all these painful physical challenges that you like get hit with like, you know, foam bumpers that try to knock you into water. And um, as the woman that I was talking to said, uh, it's a mix between Wipeout and uh, Minute to Win It. So, I, I mean, I guess it's kind of cool. And I don't know exactly what is going to happen, but I'm really excited because they called me, said that they liked my application, they wanted me to do an interview with them, a Skype interview. So, two days ago, two days ago, yesterday, it was actually yesterday, yesterday, it was yesterday before work, I went ahead and I, I got the Skype interview with the lady, and I sat there and she asked me a bunch of questions, I answered them all, and um, she seemed to like me, so she said, hey, we're going to give this video to the producer, and if the producer likes you, he's going to go ahead and, um, he's going to go ahead and call you back. So I was like, alright, that's perfect. And um, they, they said I'm probably going to hear from them soon because of the fact that they want to start shooting as soon as possible. And they have a lot of people to go through because they want a lot of people to compete. So that was really fun. And, you know, I kind of want to go into more in-depth with that as well. But you know what? That's probably for another video. So if anything, um, I know that I've been doing these videos like in sequential order where it's like, here's a video, here's a video. If anything, I think in the next two days or so or even when I get off work tonight... I'm going to try to make another video that explains all these other videos I've been t talking about. Oh my god, why? Let me in. All these other videos I've been talking about. And um, I'll just put them as like video this part two or part one or part three or something like that, you know? So, yeah. And as, as far as streaming goes, you know, streaming for Twitch, we still have no internet. We are still, it's only the second month that we've been here, so we're trying to figure out our budget and exactly how much money we're going to have in surplus at the end of the month. Which, we hit it really close. Like, Sam was really close to having no money, and I was at, like, $50. So, yeah. So, we're going to... Then again, she only worked for two weeks, because she's only been with her job for two weeks. And with me, I was just paying for pretty much everything. Um, so, it's going to be it's gonna be interesting. And now we're going to have to, like, to divvy up things. And my car insurance went down a lot, luckily, so that's going to be good. Plus, she's going to be helping pay for half of it. So I'm very excited about that. Um, you know, by so hopefully by the end of March we'll actually have like a big surplus of stuff left over, and we'll be able to get some internet, which I'll be able to start streaming again, have my computer set up, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. But anyways, guys, um, that's my update. I'm coming up on 10 minutes now, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, turn off this uh, video, 
and stay tuned for more videos you know stay tuned seriously because I'm gonna I'm gonna definitely make a video hopefully tomorrow night with the results of the X-Wing tournament if I won if not I don't know and then Monday I will make one and then hopefully Tuesday maybe I don't know or else make multiple ones on Monday and I'll just upload them on different days or all together or whatever the case may be but anyways uh, you guys have a good one and this has been my update so I will definitely go ahead and uh, make another one soon because I'm kind of upset with the fact that I haven't been making updates so yeah I want to keep you guys updated um, I just I feel like if I keep spamming too many videos it's just gonna get boring because then it's like what'd you do today oh this is this it's like yeah but I'll try to keep them entertaining anyways guys take care and stay tuned for the next video in the next two days bye